Greetings everyone, and welcome back to TCG Card Shop Simulator. Days have passed in the store since we last got together. It is now the morning of day 20. And as you can see in the upper right, I have made good use out of those days. We now have $5,340.95. More importantly, the shop is now level 13. I kind of grinded out one more day than I wanted to because I did want to get the shop to level 13 because it unlocks something that I really want. My viewers have told me the reason I'm getting more people in the store is because of the expansions. So I thought, why don't we do a couple more? The last expansion I wanted was the one for level 13. So let's just take a quick look at it. So these are the ones we have, and this is the next group. So this one, we're going to do that. This guy here, I needed to be a level 13 for. So we're going to do that one as well. This one is going to require 15. This one's going to require 17. So we're going to have to wait until 17 until we get that whole wall there. I wasn't going to do one of them because. You know, it's very claustrophobic, and I think this is going to work out pretty well for now. So let's just throw this stuff in here. And we'll do the same thing with this. Oh, I didn't know they locked. Oh, that's going to save me some space. Yeah, I did not know that that was a thing. I was putting space in between them because I thought that's what I had to do. Oh, that's going to work out really nicely. Hold it a second. That means I'm going to be able to put another one there. That's going to help me with my plans because I do have plans for the rest of that money. Now, the first thing I want to do is I want to put down some more cards over here. My viewers tell me that if I put the same product in multiple places, it's possible that the customers will buy them from multiple places. For instance, let's say the same product existed here and here. You might get somebody buy the product here and then go over here and buy the same product again. And if there is one product I want my customers buying, it's the rare boxes. So why don't we give them some more? Meanwhile, we're also going to throw in the epic card packs because I can unlock them now. Now, the first thing we're going to need, of course, is we're going to need the single sided shelf. Yeah, I mean, the store would have to be really big for me to get the double-sided ones. Just saying. As a matter of fact, I was thinking, you know, if we do unlock the whole thing over here, we could probably stick another row of tables in pretty easily. We just don't have room for that now. Because after all, product is more important. This is just to get them into the store. All right, where is this? All right, let's just put this right on the edge if we can. Oh, no, too much. Boom, there we go. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to unlock, which is now available, the Epic Card Pack, and I'm going to buy two of them. Yeah, this one is waiting for level 16. I'm guessing the money on this is going to be awesome. Yes, and I see you down there, legendary cards. I see you down there. All right, so let's unlock this. It's going to be 800. Yeah, our money is vanishing quickly. And I'm going to need two of these. I'm also going to need four of these if I'm going to fill the top and the bottom. So I think I have another one over in the corner, but I think it only has three in it. And after all, we're going to need to refill anyway. So yeah, that's expensive. All right, I'm down to 1708. This is all I'm planning on for now. All right, let's see. Where are the cards? Here they are. Yeah, I got to remember to set the price before we begin. Otherwise, people will be getting them for nothing. Apparently, I did that. I just don't remember doing that. Hold on a minute. This one here. Yeah, and I don't have any cards over here because I haven't gotten any in a while. All right, let's see. All right, so that's what I want to do. I want to put them on the top and the bottom, and I'm hoping that they will sell better. 
When I'm not doing anything, I do have a habit of standing here and watching what is being sold. That way I can get an idea of what I need to refill and what people are actually buying. For instance, I did buy the, um, the blue dice. I said I was going to do that. Here's the thing about the dice. But before I do anything else, I got to set that price because I don't want to forget it. All right, now let's see. Let's do a quick comparison here. All right, the market price is 480. I'm doing 550. You know, I probably could increase that one. All right, I'm going to leave it for now. All right, so let's see what we have here. The market price is 741. And that just is giving me a profit. Yeah, the thing is, these are more expensive, so people aren't going to be buying them very much. Nine? All right, let's see if they sell for $9. Let's see. I'm making a good profit on that. So uh, even though I don't have many of them, it'll give me motivation for buying more if I can uh, actually sell these guys. So we'll just leave it like that for now. Right. So here's the thing. I dropped the price on the red so they would sell a little better. So I dropped them from 22 to 21 and they're selling okay. So I picked up the blue ones down here. And you might notice that they're set at 18. Now, they naturally cost less in the shop for some reason, but I couldn't sell one until I dropped it to 18. I did a day of 21, a day of 20, and a day of 19, did not sell one. 18, that's when they started selling. And as you can see, they actually kind of did sell. So, I mean, I'm making a decent profit on them, so I will probably refill. I just don't know if I'm going to do any more dice. We'll have to see about that. Maybe when I have a lot more space and a lot more racks. But the thing is, I think what I should do, however, is I think I should buy one of these. Because I need to open so that I can put something out. Because let's take a look at my best card right now. Yeah, 136. So, yeah, that's not really very good. Is that the same card over there? Doesn't that look like the same card? I guess maybe it's shiny. Yeah, it's got like a shiny background. It's a good thing I don't have to play this game. I'm selling all my best cards. All right. I don't think I have to fill any. Do I have to fill any? No. I'm doing this because one, two, three, four, five. All right, let's open it up. Okay, that was definitely worth it right there. It doesn't matter if the... Oh, that's a three... Wow. Two of them in one pack. That one pack was worth... 44.38. Wow, can I have another one like that? It doesn't even matter if I get nothing else at this point. Because the luck on that was just outstanding. Okay, that was a good one. And that's not bad. I can sell those. I can definitely sell those. It's like I said, it's a good thing I'm not playing this game because I'd be like, wow, I could beat everybody with that. Okay, that pack sucked, but I'm not going to complain. Just the last one? Okay, one last one. Yeah, wait till I'm drowning in money and I can open up legendary packs. I guess that's when you get the card setups that are in the cases. Because these guys are sitting out here, but there's like big cases where you can put cards into. Alright, so let's fill these guys in. And let's put these in the corner. I do have some extra product over here. Alright, let me put some cards up. Alright, let's start putting some prices on these. Now this was a new one. You know, I want to get something for this. I'm going to say... I'm going to say 31 for now. It probably won't sell, but I got to tell you, they've been a little bit more, you know, buying in regards to some of the prices here. Uh, let's do a round on that. We'll say 25 for that one. So... Sure, we'll do that. Uh, market price. Oh, actually, I already had a price on that one, didn't I? Probably should have left it alone. 
and that one is set. We'll just take that. All right, I think we're good to go. Everything is filled up. I dropped the price of the sleeves. They're at uh, 345 and they are selling pretty quickly now. Uh, I'm not sure what the profit margin. It's a good profit margin if you make it up in volume, right? We'll see. I do have other products I want to buy, but for now, I need to make money because I'm down to 16.16.03. And we already have our first stinker of the day. You. Now he's shining. The world will thank me. You know, I can't help but notice that a lot of the epic card packs are selling. This is the third person who had a big wad of them. And I'm wondering if I need to adjust the price quickly. What does this guy have? I know he was in the area too. Yeah, by the way, this guy, the fact that he's slow is really starting to become an issue. See, there are five people online now. Oh, and it looks like someone bought the second card here too. Actually, they bought these two. They didn't buy the big one over here. Okay, I think he had an epic one there too. I might have to buy another uh, card pack for that one. All right, you, you got the commons. Yeah, I mean, they are going down there. It makes me wonder if I should add an, like, another 50 cents or something to the price. Um, you know what? Why don't we just see about that? 10%? No, not that quite. Uh, why don't we say 9.45? I mean, because I don't want to cheat myself. If they're selling really quick, uh, that could be a problem. Yeah, this guy is, uh, especially if there's a lot of individual packs, because he does that reaching out every time, and he's got the delay just like you see here. But to be fair, I mean, that's what we bought. If you see him right here, check out speed, slow. Now, ironically, the next person is an opposite of this guy, because checkout speed is normal, restock is slow, this one's got restock and normal, and this one has checkout is slow. Yeah, the ones at the bottom, when you're 45th level, they're very fast. Yeah, but it is a good thing that there's no uh, impatience set up in the game, where people will just get annoyed and leave. Uh, it's kind of the same thing with other games like this, where they have the the stuff on them and they can't leave because they can't put it back on the shelves. So once they pick something up, they're stuck. All right, what do you have? Okay, he wanted a whole bunch of covers there. Like I said, when I dropped the price, they started selling well. I think I have more. Yes, I do. So let's just do a quick refill. Uh, no item in box. I mean, it's still four people. Is it four? Yeah, it was four. Yeah, and the dice are selling a lot too, I noticed. All right, no reason to restock at this point, though. Right. I can't help but notice that the, um, the rare boxes are not selling. And that's really what I wanted to sell, wasn't it? All right, let's see. We still have three others online. All right, common. You should get a rare box. Those rare cards are amazing. I got some great things from them. Oh, he bought one of the cards? Uh, he didn't buy the big one. They should buy the big one. They'll win more games. Store is really starting to get busy now. The one thing is I can't help but notice that nobody is buying the, um, the rare card boxes. At least I haven't seen any yet. I don't know, maybe this guy's buying one? I mean, they are a big part of my profits. Yeah, the sleeves. Is this a situation where they have to buy something, and if you have a lot more things, maybe they'll buy more of the cheap things? Maybe I should only sell those. That would be interesting. Probably make a lot of money doing that. All right. It is getting late. 
and we're we're close to 2500 again so we are making money it's just that obviously we're going to have a bad profit day because we spent a lot of money a whole lot remember we finished we started i should say 5340 and then we were 1660 when the day began so we spent a lot so we're not really going to get a good idea of profits today but sales we'll see the sales that's a thing I mean, they're buying these. I just, I don't see any of, oh, I see one. Somebody bought one. Yippee. Who was the one person? Okay, you want common packs. Common packs are for common people. Should buy the good ones. Go buy some epic ones. You'll be epic then. Well, we're after 8 o'clock, and as you can see, the tables are filling up. This would be the time to have more tables for more money. Especially if we have more people coming in. See, they're all full at the moment. All right, 21. Yeah, we still haven't sold any more than that one. It is going to make restocking easier. Oh, somebody just grabbed one. Okay, so he grabbed that one. Can he grab another one? Nope, he didn't. All right, so I have sold two of the boxes that I really want to sell. I did buy um, another box of those, so I got four more of those because we were emptying out. Oh, wow. She just bought... Yes! You just won customer of the day. That's what I want to see. I think I have some more over here. Yeah, right here. I had no reason to pull them out. There we go. That's what I want to see. Because that's big money. How much is that going to be anyway? All right, so that was $132.75. That's what I want to see. This is a good customer right here. All right, we are at 9 o'clock now. So do we have... Okay, we got three on... The one thing I've seen is that if 9 o'clock comes and he has a line, he can't leave. Normally, he would leave immediately, but if he has a line, he can't leave. And I'm so happy about that. I hope you're trapped here forever. Come on. Somebody else get online. Somebody else get online. I'm going to get online. I'm online. I'm online. All right. So we have over 3,000, which is pretty darn good, considering we started with 1616. 16, and I did spend about 50 bucks, you know, for one of those boxes over there. All right. Now, unfortunately, this means I'm going to have to do this. Let's see if I remember. Oh my goodness, that is wonderful. Wonderful indeed. Wonderful, wonderful. Oh, an exact change. You are like the best customer ever. 3200 And of course, we got some money from that. Um, yeah, my viewers told me how to handle this. Just kind of like cue him. Get out. Oh, are you going to buy something? Do I need to get another... I got one missing there, two there. I mean, I could get another one. It's just that I don't have to right now. Oh, my goodness. You are such a great customer. Sorry for uh, queuing you like that, but you know... Oh, exact change. But it was time for you to leave. It was for your good, you know? You would have sat there all night. It would have been terrible. I'd have turned the lights off and everything. All right, I guess I'm waiting for them to be done now. All right, that was good. Good money there. All right, that was a great game, people. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you very much. You have a good night. Be safe. All right, so very nearly 3,300. So let's take a look at the numbers. Yeah, the profit's going to suck because um, we spent a lot right over here. However, if we look at it, the earnings were not too bad at all. And I sold a lot of those cards except for the big one. I'm going to let it go for another day. See if somebody wants it at 31. And maybe take it down to 30. We'll see. All right. So hopefully today will be better. Even though I do want to make some more purchases. All right. So here's the thing. I can fit something in here. So I intend to put something in there. Another one of these racks. As a matter of fact, let me just get the rack right now. All right, that's 200. 
All right, we still have more than 3,000. You know, I should pay the uh, the bill. Here's the thing. Yeah, I was thinking with the expansions, that's what it was. So it's about $60 more because of the expansions because it was a bit over 200 with my employee and what we previously had. So uh, it is increasing, but, you know, we do want to make more money, don't we? And you have to... Um, invest for that all right now can i fit you in there yep fits like a glove all right so here's what i want to do i want to get into plushies so let's do plushies it'll bring in a whole new clientele now if we go over to figurines i see that we have one for 500 Ooh, i'd be betting the farm on that wouldn't i Let's open one. Okay, that's a package of 12. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna do it. We're gonna do this. All right, one of those, and one of those. Yeah, it's really going to uh, cut into us. Here's the thing, I was also wondering whether or not I wanted to buy one of these decks. I mean, it's a hundred to unlock. All right, why don't we do this? And it's a hundred. All right, but the thing is, all right, we're under a thousand now, but we are going to have some new product lines in there. All right, so let's see about this. Here is my plan. All right, now the decks, I'm hoping that they will fit in here. Yeah, good, good, good. Because I want to have the, um, the plushies on shelves of their own okay is that gonna be two yep yep that's gonna fit in two okay that's good that's kind of what i was hoping for all right and now we have these and of course i have to set the prices okay six there six there all right that's great now i have to set prices and i'm hoping that we're going to make a lot more money because i just spent a lot all right, let's take a look at this. Okay, market value. Let me think about that. Maybe 22? All right, let's think about that for a moment. That's 22. The market price is 18.35. Now, I have these guys. I think that works out. That should be fine. All right, we're going to leave that one for now. If it doesn't sell, I can always drop the prices. All right, now this is the big stuff right here because this was expensive. All right, now what is your... Wow! All right, let's see what we can do here. I think that's way too much. Let's do like they do in the stores. $36.95. And that was a base of 30 Okay, what is the other one down here? How about $37.95? Yeah, I'm running alone on the boxes here, but I don't think I can afford to buy anything at the moment. Do I have anything extra? What is this? Oh, these are the cards. You know what? We need to open some more. Yep, that's what we're going to do. We're going to open some more. One, two, three, four, five. Because that certainly worked out well the last time. Wow, the only card that didn't sell is right there. Like I said, I'm going to leave it for one more day. All right. Anything really good? Well, that was okay. I can put it up if nothing else comes in there. Ooh, very nice. Oh, that's not bad. That was a very good one. When we have a lot more money, we can do this with the epics. And then the legendaries. Terrible pack, but I'm not going to complain. Terrible pack, but I'm not going to complain because of the other ones we got. Right, is this the last one? Yep, that's it. All right, we did get some good ones. Let me throw them up. Four new cards. So let's see what we're going to sell them for. 
uh, market price, add, add. I could live with that. All right, so let's try this one. And market price, round up. All right, and then this one over here. Market price, one more. One more, there, that's okay. That one. Yeah, what did I have this one set at? 21. Uh, if I did a negative one. Round. All right, we'll just, we'll try to do that to sell it. All right, hopefully all five of them will sell. All right, now I do need to reload this. I mean, I don't think it's an emergency yet because we do have a lot of them. And these guys here, we can buy them once we see them selling a lot. Um, I would like to get back to a decent amount of money before, um, before spending any more. Oh, and that does remind me, did I do? Oh, I did do the, um, the bills. Okay, that's a good thing. Another day in the shop. All right, we're approaching noon and I am seeing the, um, oh wow, somebody bought that first card. Okay, well, we got the money. See, like um, three of them have already sold. I am seeing these guys going now pretty frequently. I don't know what was going on yesterday. So I think I need two boxes. Wow, I may need three boxes. Three boxes of them and probably two boxes of the common. So I should probably get to ordering. Because after all, you must have product in order to sell product. Boom. And we still have 1,200 after doing that. All right, let's just load them back up. That's good. There we go. Okay, is there anything up there? I don't remember ordering that many. All right, I think we're good with these. Yeah, the cards are becoming a problem. All right, hold it a second. Let's put these guys over here. I need common cards. I didn't even realize that. Anything down here? Okay, there we go. All right, let's see here. Yeah, we got space up here. And it's empty. Apparently, they like the decks. All right, that's good. We'll have something else to sell. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to have to get some of them. We're okay with this because we do have a box over there. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, those guys are dangerous. I saw one sit down and I saw three groups, three games end all at once. And they were all saying, oh, the stench. So yeah, those guys can really hurt you financially. So I spray them whenever I see that. Yeah, I need that. Let's just grab some cards. It's not something I have to do often, but... Oh, that's actually not the one that I wanted, is it? Okay, well, I got another. You know what? I could take that one off. Yeah, kill that one. Right, this is what I wanted. Because I need the cards. All right, get over here. Oh, another. Where are you? Yeah, because he's going to sit down there, isn't he? All right. All right, and let me get the box. Fortunately, this appears to be a safe neighborhood for uh, cards and they don't vanish outside. All right, there we go. Nice and full. 
I also noticed that there was some opportunities for filling these. Yep, completely full. It's starting to get late in the store. And of course we got four games going on, which is great. Um, we still have that one card left. I'm not sure what the problem with that one is, but I'm guessing someone will pick it up. Uh, I noticed that the plushies are selling. It's ironic that the one I thought I set too high a price is selling better than the other one. I'm guessing that they're all going to sell. That'd be good. Uh, the dice, I don't have to refill now. Uh, we'll see how this goes before I open any more. I just wanted to get one of them. You know, the red one, there's a whole bunch of colored ones before I dedicate a shelf to it. You know, I just want to see if they sell. Otherwise, we're doing okay. Uh, the boxes are definitely going better now, which is good. I don't know what the problem with yesterday was. And I do know what your problem is. Let's see. Oh, he was leaving. Okay, well, then that's good. He was leaving. All right, 2163, and we still have some more time left. Okay, 1307 over here. Can we get another game going? Is somebody coming? Somebody that doesn't have to be fumigated because you need to be fumigated. You know, somebody better get in there fast. Otherwise, um, he's going to have to get kicked out. Oh, there you go. All right, so we got three games going and it is and he just left. It is possible that they'll buy something on the way out. So, um, yeah, I better keep an eye open. And nobody wanted to buy anything. Hey, you know what? I made money off of the games and that's what's important. We now have 2400. We started with less than a thousand because of our purchases. So let's just see how it worked out for us. At least they were buying the rare boxes. Okay, 1400 on the item earnings, 72 bucks on the card earnings. And the games, you know, 429, not bad at all. I mean, we did spend again today. You know, upgrade costs, we got 1500, supply over a thousand. So, you know, about 900 loss. It's the way it is. It'll work out better because for now, I'm not going to do any upgrading. I'm just going to buy supplies. And that will allow us to uh, build up a nice nest egg for our next uh, operation. Yeah, I can't do the next one until level 15 and the one after that until level 17. But what I can do is I can buy refills and sell stuff in the store. Maybe I'll get some more good cards. We'll have to see how that works out. Anyway, that's going to be it for now. So we did another two expansions and we have new products. We put the diet, we, pardon me, we put the deck in there and we have plushies. So we'll see how well they sell. I don't know, maybe I should drop the prices. I'll let it go another day and then I'll make a decision on that. They do seem to be buying the rare boxes now. They weren't buying it yesterday, which is a little bit strange. I don't know, I guess it's just complete randomness or something like that. Nice of you to show up. Anyway, that's going to be it for now. If you enjoyed the episode, please give it a like. Maybe say something in the comments for the Great God algorithm. And of course, subscribing is a great way to show your support. So thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. Isn't that true? See ya.